Welcome back to Galaxy of Pen and Paper, dear viewer. I had to replay that fight against dogs, the cat meme, because uh, exiting out of the app before you reach a point where all your team has options to choose their adventure apparently does not save the game. So yes, do not exit the game until you are at a point where your team is all sitting and comfortable. We got the plate of cat sticker again. Looks like you've got disconnected. Anyway, we're going to go through this again. And then we'll have a very large choice. Do we try to download what's left of this meme, dogs? Or do we say nope? So, decision time. Do we try to download something that can literally download the future, which may be why the future guys are trying to kill us? Or do we play it safe? Say nope. No cats and dogs for us. Cat meme named dogs. Eh, yeah, we'll download it. Link quickly downloads all the data relating to dogs. The data is badly corrupted. I'll start a background function to restore it this very instant. Also, I'll save it in a floppy disk, as I don't feel comfortable carrying this thing around. Great, thanks Link. Let's head back now, the pressure is hurting my ears. Poor Barbara. Soldiers, it seems like the galaxy net is back to normal. I can contact you while watching cat videos and doggos. Well done. We saved the future and the galaxy net in one go. Coincidence? I think not. That's right. We also got A plus graded diploma. Raises your crit chance, your SP by 10, and regenerates your SP by 5. My word, that is a wonderful item. Ooh, and we leveled up. So Joy, this last time I actually did not need to revive anybody, since confusion kept working the entire time, but Cure-All doesn't necessarily do enough healing. So the question is, should I get first aid instead? And I think the answer is yes. So we'll unlock that. Okay. And we'll replace Cure All with First Aid. And this can also heal shields, so that'll work. And since we are much more concerned about dealing damage quickly than about other stuff, then yeah, yeah. I think we're good. Other than, we may want Trample Rush instead of this. You know what? To unlock Trample Rush. That way we can stun with Stan, set up for opportunistic strike. Okay, anything else to change? Hmm. Hmm. I remember there was something we were thinking of. Ah, uh, yes. Raise her damage further. We'll unlock this. What else was I thinking of changing? Hmm. We'll get rid of that. Instead, go for higher critical damage. Booyah. Alright then. We should be good. We can't buy any more items on this planet. I am, however, going to move Barber Fett over here. Then again. Wait a second. What do we get again? Yeah, okay. More damage. There we go. Now then, we have another campaign quest. The space plot thickens. Head to bridge to continue your journey. Let's do it, folks. All right then. I just broke a piggy bank here and found the exact amount of cash to buy a new module. Ain't that lucky? Ooh. So this is the last one. We unlock Cloud Planet. I have a feeling it will be named after Bespin somehow. Uh, we'll get the negotiator, maybe. <laughs> yeah, we want that. Yep. That, my friends, was money well spent. Okay, then. Hmm. Let's go find that planet. Or something. Hmm. It doesn't seem like whatever danger to the system there is can be found in this time period. I say the future is saved. 
As your actions become known, the system is further endangered. You'll bring about the collapse. Jeez, it's that beta dude again. What do we, uh, you do? Good catch, GM. Good catch. We'll collapse your face. Can't you help us? What's the collapse? Where do you come from? Well, we know it's the future, but yeah. Uh, can't you help us also make sense? Hmm. 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 Can you help us? What do you think I'm doing this very instant? Getting in the way of our fabulous adventures? I am acting as your guide. Can't you speak in simpler terms? To speak directly to you would shatter your perception of reality. Instead, I'll guide you by action. Or stop you entirely. Yet again. Okay. Well, we've got dead short on Barbara. That's nice. Yunk. Short circuit. The first dude. There we go. And then, we can cause confusion. Which one is he? I think that guy. Because it looks like we couldn't see him highlighted. Because he goes next. Aha. No, he resisted everything. Well, fuck. Ah, Stan, don't die. They do have really cool looking attacks. Oh, and we got pushed back. Well, that's not terrible. It's much better than dying. Yep, still better than dying. And if we lose a little bit of attack power, that's okay. We steal deal quite a bit. You know what, we're just going to normal attack. I'm going to try to mark with Bad Ape and set up for the combo. Marking. There we go. And Dead Short has been replaced, so we need to use it again. And we'll probably take out this dude. Nope, I'm wrong. Okay, then. Um, Stan could use some healing. So we will heal Stan. Yoink. Alright, Stan. Don't you die on me. And that is why we healed Stan. That guy resisted our mark. Hmm. Lame. Okay, that guy is still marked. Nice. Okay. We got a dead short on Bad Ape. That's not great. Unfortunately, these guys are not in a line. Actually, wait. Does the back count as a straight line? Hmm. Well, for now, we want to just take out one at a time. So I'm not going to worry about that too much yet. Ooh, and we got spread damage, which didn't apply because they're not next to each other. Well, great. Charge attack instead. Ooh, when we got tactical sight triggered. Ooh, yeah. Okay, it still has dead short, so we can use this ability. Yoink. And you know what? I really should have equipped that new item before I started combat. That was an oversight. Oh, well. Stan, don't die on me. If only the heal would get rid of the burn effect, too. But, nope. That'd probably be too good. Hmm. Well... The nebula is starting to smell a little bit like roasted human flesh. And simian flesh. And green flesh, apparently. Oh, thank you for moving me back to dealing more damage. Oh yeah, good resist, good resist. Now we're going to see. Will this deal a line to the back? Immune to stun, of course. No, it's a straight line from back to front. Or front to back, I should say, instead of down this line. Unlike Ridley's ability. Ridley, you were too cool. But also not damaging enough. So, I think this is better. Okay. This guy's marked, so we definitely will hit. That guy was also marked, so okay. Never mind. There's dead short. And now... I don't think we need to worry too much about healing, now that there's only two of them. And Stain is no longer burned, so we're going to try to Confuse instead. Confuse. Enjoy. 
because <laughs> her name is Joy. Enjoy. Kind of a pun, maybe. Maybe. Nah, it was pretty bad. Okay. E N J O Y. Yeah, I don't know if that counts as a pun or not. Oh well, Stan, deal damage. Save me. Ooh, okay. That was pretty good damage with that hit. Hmm. I'm glad I kept you on the team, Betty. Now we may need more healing. Hmm. Charge attack. Yoink. With tactical side, that should be an automatic critical damage attack. And now that this guy has dead short, we can use this and set him on fire. And that will deal with him. All right then. Joy, do we heal? Do we confuse? I think we confuse. Confusion is pretty good. All right. And now we don't have that ability with Barbara where we get rid of a shield entirely with her normal attacks. But considering we're not using her normal attacks very often, it wasn't really worth it in my opinion. I think this is better. We know the stun doesn't work. Opportunistic strike thus is kind of worthless on boss characters apparently. Which is rather sad. And it looks like we do need to mark this guy again. Um, or we could just deal damage. Which is better. I think we're going to deal damage, because uh, Joy needs to attack as well. And maybe, just maybe, does he have dead short still? Oh! Wrong ability. Okay. Well, that was suboptimal. Anyway, we need to attack with Joy to get SP back. Then we can heal people so they don't die from fire. Mm, yeah. Okay. I think he's still immune to stun, so we're just going to normal attack. And deal a ton of damage. From the back row. You deal less damage in the front row, Stan. Huh. I wonder if that's like a hidden ability, or just... Random? I'll take it. I'm not complaining, I'm just, you know... Saying that seems a bit off. Hmm. Okay, so he didn't have dead short, so we're going to apply it. And deal a ton of damage. Okay, now we need to heal. Closest to dying is Bad Ape. Careful, Bad Ape. Be healed. By science. Evidence-based medicine. That's what we call it these days. Okay, so dead short is gone now. Yeah, we'll just normal attack. Okay. And we'll just have to normal attack as well. And he's dodging. Hmm. And he refreshes SP. We will see. Barbara may be able to take him down with this burn crit combo, but that is not the case. Okay. Hmm. We'll refill some more SP on Joy. It's probably unnecessary. We'll probably finish this with Barbara. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. Oh, he's not wasting his turn by moving. Why not? He totally should. It's bad for you, but you totally should. Okay, team attack maybe? No? Okay, fine. Well, Barbara... I don't see dead short, so let's reapply it and probably finish this. Booyah. And that is why we have the high damage team. Ooh. We got more exodermal nano armor. While the danger to the system's future lives, so will I. Even if it takes until the end of times. I think he vanished. Er, I mean... The strange creature disappears! I'm the GM, I know everything. I guess six weeks in the future is not enough for this guy. He should go even further this time. Or we should go even further this time. Yeah, to an age with proper hoverboards. Just head to the time chamber once you're ready. Oh yeah, in the far future, I don't think the people you know now will be uh, available. So be sure to finish any side missions you've taken before you time travel. Thank you for that note, GM. And did Link change color? It looks like he's a darker blue now. Fascinating. Well, dear viewer, 
I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you for watching and have a great day.